and good morning ladies yep we're in getting cows in this morning they're in the furthest paddock on the farm so i thought i'd better go get them in this morning just uh save dad getting here at like quarter past five <laughs> hello how are you jamie uh, jamie going with guns but that's offensive <laughs> Oh, so it's going to be a beautiful day. It's nice and clear skies again this morning. <laughs> so let's see what we can see. Oh, Jamie! <laughs> Neighbours on. Local townships on. Big fur, big cow sheds on. Oh, you can see that fire over there today. in there with his mates and cows are all uh, locked in the shed the little calf went under the fence and out in this paddock while I was getting the rest of the cows in getting pretty still come on girls come on girls really well cows out there washing the yard what do I think we're going to see today 55 80 I reckon up 100 litres that the cycle through. And I don't even see it, there's a cross light on the back. Woohoo! Shows you how well the monkey shows how much grass we got. Dad's just washing up the yard down there. We've got a bit of colostrum out of the cow's stomach. There's uh, three coming off the bucket in the next one. It's just going to finish up the yard. We're going to hang up these cups and we'll go out and feed some little calves. Got a few going on the bobby lorry today. Keepers, Dad's decided to keep that one that we got in yesterday, that one there. Awesome. So that. And also that uh, other brown black white face there. Let's uh, look at getting these ones on the bobby. And we got two, four, six. Bang on. So he's only got five left in that pen there. Perfect. And the four left to carve are all heifers. So we've got these just to tag, feed them. Put him under Bobby. Carvey's in the Bobby calf trailer. Let's go feed these older ones. Gonna give them the injection and a drink. Dad's headed out the gate. We've got one very annoying little calf here, number 29. Be the oldest one out here. And we'll wait for Dad to get to the gate and we'll get a move on. So these calves have been drenched and vaccinated with a 7 and 1. We'll probably get to weaning these calves off on the uh, this weekend. So I'm only feeding 15 calves. See the ones with the blue dots, those are the ones Dad's done with the seven and one. So he's done all his ones up as runoff too. So he's got these ten, he's got six to go out here, another five in there. And that's it. Which one is the runner? Who was a runner this morning? That one over there. That one is heading off out in the paddock. He did a runner this morning. <laughs> right. All sorted, let's get to washing up. And done. A little carvies in there waiting for the truck. Oh, 
All washed up, cleaned up. Those are just bucket stairs. We'll wash those buckets soon. All right, that's it. Go down and feed those cows some silage. It's a pretty quick day today. We got our two uh, two bales here. We're only going to see how many we feed out. We'll judge it by how well they're eating now. Um, take a tractor down. Dad's ready to head down to go check the dry cows. Come back and get the calves their meal. And we'll meet them at the gate for the uh, girls here. All down and go feed these two bales of silage. Dad's already checked on the... Uh, Cows are here for still the calf down there. We're all good. So let's go. There's uh we're gonna decide whether we feed out one bale or two. But I'll still load up with a second bale, but that'll just be for tonight. It's all on out. They definitely needed that second bale of silage. There's a lot of grass up here, but then dives off into that, uh, it dives into the um, peat there. It drops off a bit, and same with, with down the back of that paddock. I'm just gonna feed some little carvies. Feed me. Remember last year we had hundreds out here, but, well, 100 out here, 150 odd, but this year maximum is gonna be our 80. It's us this morning. We've not got too much planned today. It is a beautiful day to do any spraying or rolling. We actually got a um, couple of things we've got to do. The bees are working hard on this uh, willow here. And there's the bee fellas down there. Awesome. Oh, well, that, I'll see you all later at milking tonight. We've got a few other things we've got to do today. Go sort out some more paperwork. As usual. Thank you. And. Those little carvies are locked out. Get out to the paddock and graze, little fellas. With that, I'll see you all at milking tonight. 19 calves with 60 litres of milk. We shovel. How's your water? All out of water. How's your meal? How's your meal? Still got some meal. Gate system. Move their water trough into here. Those little carvies will be happy. Good afternoon, everybody. With that paperwork taken care of, we are ready to go spread some furt. That's uh, plan tomorrow. Spread some furt. But yeah, we're off to go milk the cows now. It's just gone uh, ten to three. Let's go and wash the vat. Let's see how much milk we see. It'll be easy work feeding the calves tonight. <laughs> Hello, you five. There he goes. Spot up the top there. The uh, hot water cylinder's full. And you know what we said today? These are correct. It's been a great day. We said 57.26. Awesome. We're up. About 200 litres on yesterday's pickup. So that's fantastic. Didn't expect them to go up that much yet. So Dad's been reducing the amount that he's been giving those calves out um, around the house and up at his place. So it's not long before the ones up at his place are going to be weaned off and the ones up at uh, around my house are going to be weaned off as well. So then we're only feeding 15 calves and we've got those two, there's four to go down the swat, down the paddock there. And of those four, all four are heifers. Three are very close and one's probably about two weeks away. That was just that bull was left out a little bit late. Here, here comes the girls now. They're just passing the clip tank. We're ready. Shall we get and to And the uh, backing gate has been fixed, so it better be working now. We just tried it. It's still a little bit worse for wear, but it's not uh, too bad. Could be worse. <laughs> All right, shall we get to milking? Beautiful afternoon. 
afternoon, beautiful day. Grass is grown. It's a good one. There they go, they don't know what they're doing. There, just let them go. Oh, leaving so early they go. That's why he's just pushed them up into the yard. So, let's get them away. She's a good girl, hey, 260. Cracker. Oh, yes, they're milking away here. Hi, oh, girls, push, push. Yep, this is the last lucky fork. Lucky red. There goes Dad, he's off to go feed those calves out in the front paddock. And he's just finished feeding those. These calves don't get fed tonight. And they're staying outside tonight. Let's see how they handle their first night outside. <laughs> if they all wake, if we get back in the morning, they're all out there. Well, then we know they didn't like being outside. But they'll get used to it. I'll get used to it. Little arrows waiting to get in the tractor. We got our bale on board, just the one tonight. And they're the first time in the big paddock. Let's see if they've actually spread out to the second paddock today. The, the, the big paddock down the back to connect it to now. We have got plans to turn what was those four paddocks into three, but that's not till next year. With the, we've just got to wait for some better weather to do it. It's a bit drier. It's a bit easier to fill in those uh, old drains or cap off those old drains, sort of thing, and fill, uh, bring in new drains. Alright, let's go. Head out first cow push through. She's on that side, which is good that now with her over there, they'll think that uh, both sides now. Alright, it's gonna be interesting getting the girls in in the morning. A bit of a change of pace. And with that, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the morning. Thank you.